Hello, everyone. If you're watching this on YouTube, you missed a whole debacle while I was trying to get my right Joy-Con to work live. Because as soon as I tried starting the stream, it just didn't respond anymore. So thanks, Nintendo. Oh, uh, come on. Star Wars memes, come on. It's working! Uh, now this is pod racing. Uh, for real, this is splatting. Oh, my girl Amy Rose is in the corner there. I'm not going to be reading their dialogue for now. Because we've- I, I did this yesterday. Hey, hey! So, if you missed it, the other day I am Team Gear. Which is objectively the best team. But of course, Team Scissors was objectively the best team last time. And well, we all know how Big Man Sweet turned out. Does he look like a salmon? I don't know. He does have kind of a vacant look in his eyes. Imagine how powerful little buddy would be if he had that cute three mouth. Hang on, I gotta I gotta fresh my girl Amy. Booyah. <laughs> Food motivated. You know, I didn't show off the dancing last time, but I love all the dancing that they've added to the game. So like, some of them's pretty good. That's some fancy foot movement. And like, some people have rhythm. It's not like the most elegant, but they're trying. I don't even know. Just jump, they never expect it. Ooh, yeah. That's good art. I don't know who they are, but that's, that's some good art. Where is the one that's like doing the Macarena? I need to find that one before I do any actual matches. Oh, look, even she's dancing. <laughs> I wonder if it's uncomfortable for fish to walk around on land. I guess not. Splat vein is still here, wonderful. Fear. I feel like I'm gonna lose an eye if I stand in the middle of this. Here for a good time, not a long time. That sounds like something Sylvain would say. Ah hanging out with your buddies. I found them! See, the Macarena lives on. Even several thousand years into the future. I mean, it's not quite the Macarena, but a lot of the steps are there. And it's still just as embarrassing. God, even the jellies are doing it. <laughs> Beautiful. I'm so glad I found this. Alright. I'm gonna play some Ding Dang Sploon before my Joy-Con breaks again. Or I start getting sick from uh, this vaccine booster. So I didn't say during the recording, but actually just like a couple hours ago, I was able to get the um, bivalence Moderna uh, booster dose. So that's exciting, but also I'm anticipating getting hit pretty hard with it because that's what I've been hearing is that it's the side effects can be pretty nasty. God, these shoes look so uncomfortable. Let's wear them. But let's see. Oh, let's hop into a match. Why not? In an attempt to make Salmon run easier, you've dropped your rank once. But that meant the people you're playing with have no idea what they're doing. <laughs> you dropped like two more ranks because of it. Oh no! And Dora, do you want to do some Salmon? Because I know I'm here to do Splatfest, but if you want to do some Salmon on stream, I'd be down with that. Maybe I'll even get like a stream recording of that weird bug I've been getting where despite a successful clear, I get a pay kite. Love to get a Twitch clip of that. <laughs> maybe maybe someone else will come forward and say, Hey, I've had the same thing happen to me. Or Mr. Grizz just has it out for me personally. Okay. You know, I was doing some anarchy battles here a few days ago, and I... Hadn't done anarchy battles on uh, Mahi Mahi Resort until then, and I didn't realize that the pool layout was so different. That there's just there's a lot of um, there's a lot more holes that you can fall through. Ask me how I know. Just gonna put this here. I better move. Or I'm gonna get shot in the back by people respawning. Oh, the Luna Blaster's up there. 
Uh-oh. I better go before I get shot. Blah! 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 You're up for whatever splatting? I don't, for, I don't remember. What team are you on? Not gear, right? Oh, okay. Better not press forward by myself or that's not gonna end well. Uh oh, here comes the zip caster Luna. Oh. <laughs> I don't know if that was worth it. Oh, you are team gear. Well. If you wanna do some Splatfest matches with me. I don't know how much of a crowd I'm gonna generate for afternoon splat, especially because a lot of people are probably playing on their own. Oh, nice. Yeah, I see over there. Uh-oh. There we go. Only one roller may reign supreme, and it's not you. Uh-oh, uh-oh, it might not be me either. Oh, good. Thank you, friend. It is not time for crab. Good, good, good. I love feeling powerful. That's why you use a roller when you just... You, sometimes you just gotta squish. Boy, Splat Boy sounds like an insult, doesn't it? Yeah, whatever, Splat Boy. I mean no actual shade toward my teammates. I just mean it sounds funny. Oh! Oh, uh-oh, I'm stuck. I'm get stuck. Oh, God! Yeah. Wow, 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 wow. It feels like as soon as I get splatted, everything just goes to pieces. Uh oh. Wah, like that. Embarrassing. Well, after this one, I will make a little friend lobby if you would like to join me. If you're up for it. No pressure if you're not. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, that was embarrassing. Well, an attempt was made. <sighs> I hope you're all doing well on this Saturday afternoon or whatever time. Oh, we did it! Nice! Whatever time of day it may be. Um, it's pretty hot out today, but not like unbearable heat wave like it was even a few weeks ago. Although just going for like like a 10 minute walk for to get to the pharmacy where my vaccine dose was scheduled. It was still pretty dang toasty by the time I got there. Cool. Okay, I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna make a friend lobby. I should have eaten some friend food, but I did not. Oh, and doors in a match. Well, I will. I will sit around and wait for them. Maybe I will have a look at lockers in the interim, since I'd like to appreciate the hard work that goes into these. <laughs> and mine. I want one of these, like, wacky, waving, inflatable arm tube squids. Where can I get one of those? Hmm. Somebody really likes, like, off-brand squid, cat, and crunch. What is, what is even those cans up there? Crude oil. Definitely not crude oil, but... Boy, some people really like playing locker Jenga, huh? <laughs> uh, oh, there's our first Moai. I'm surprised they've, they've kind of gone down in occurrence. I guess because everyone real... <laughs> Everyone realize that everyone is uh, putting Moais in their lockers now, so it's not trendy anymore. I mean, that's still pretty good. I like that stack. Did we see that stack yesterday? I think we did. Or we saw a similar stack. You're done. Okay, great. I'm going to make a friend. <laughs> this, is, this is just what everyday life feels like, honestly. Like, I am that pleasure zap fish in the corner. Precariously balancing a bunch of bombs in my head. Okay. Let's... That's not what I want. I want this. Splatfest battle with friends. Still haven't come across that giant plush fish. What, like the zapfish toy? I think you get it in hero mode. I know... 
when I streamed this last week, I came across someone with at least maybe two people with that in their locker kissing the Moai. Scandalous! Okay, let's keep this crew for now. Although, did you bring a light your team gear yet? Yeah? If you would like in as well, let me know. Squish, squish. Let us hope for no embarrassing connection errors. Donuts. You know, I finally realized the purpose of the uh, the copy machine, and that it helps to test, I think, the durability of certain specials, like the Big Bubbler. Oh, you just tried joining me. Oh, oops. Okay, hang on, hang on. Um, let's see if we can have them join us after this. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't know you were trying to join. Scrub Lord. Very good. Watch, they're gonna be really powerful. As is befitting a Scrub Lord. I'm not sure, does it let people join friend lobbies that are already open, or do I have to make another one? I might have to make another one. <laughs> okay, after this I'm gonna make another friend lobby. And we'll get, uh, did you bring a light in here as well? Oh, oh, don't do that. Oh, they knew I was here. Awful. Awful. Do they know, like that fuzzy bear person, do they know that they just have the, the, the hiragana a ah at the end of their name? Like, can they read it or is it there for aesthetic purposes? I see a lot of names that just have, like, characters present for aesthetic purposes. Please don't shoot me, Charger. Thank you. Oh, oh. What did I just say? What did I just say? I don't know if it's a flings a day, but we'll see. Stop. Stop. Whoop. No. No. Uh oh. Ink storm, got the ink storm. Oh, Charger. <gasps> juice! Oh, thank you. Love to be boost from the juice. Although I've noticed there's a downside if you have Ninja Squid equipped. Um, you're, uh, you're not so stealthy when you're boost from the juice because you can see those arrow markers beside you. Ah, oh, no! Was I still boost? No, I was not still boost. My boost is worn off, so I don't get that quick respawn. That's a shame. Okay. Oh, I missed. Heck, heck, heck. No. <laughs> no, there's even juice. I want juice. Uh oh. This might be a bad idea. This might be a very bad idea. Oh, well that kind of worked out. Stop. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Ah, uh -oh. <sighs> okay. So, oh, I don't know if it'll let... Did you bring a light join me from here? So I'm just gonna make a new lobby if that's cool. Oh. Uh... No! I'm sorry, Poppy! I'm sorry, I'm Team Gear! But it's funny, a couple of my friends are Team Fun. Like, we seem to be fairly evenly split. How are you enjoying Splatfest, Poppy? Everyone is Team Gear. 
I know several of my friends are team fun, and then there's team grub. Okay, I'm gonna make a new lobby. So, did you bring a light can join in? Oh, hola Nando! And anyone else who may be lurking, hang on, I keep- I keep scrolling like that, and I don't mean to. Oh, and they're in a match, okay. Well, we'll wait a, la a round for did you bring a light to finish. Ugh, hang on, I need to do a big stretch. Ugh. Do I have you friended, Poppy? Um, because I should- I should friend you. Um, my friend code is on my- hang on, let me- let me- buh, 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 buh. Let me bring it up. I'm trying so hard not to knock my whole setup over so I don't lose tracking on my Octo. <laughs> Hang on. I'm just gonna... Eh, 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 eh. Eh, okay. There's my switch friend code. Bam. Uh, the Octo model, I didn't actually make it. My pal Belle made it for me. Um, she is not here right now, unfortunately. Um, but it was all done by her, specifically all the blend shapes. So she manually did all the blend shapes so I can emote. <laughs> um, I can even puff out my cheeks like, mm, you know, when I get beat by team <laughs> gear or, or rather team fun. Oh, there we go. We got, did you bring a light? Oh, and the ink brush. Excellent choice. <laughs> um, I will, I don't know if Belle would ever make more available for other people. But, because this was, I think, like a, a side project of hers. But it's so dang cute, right? Didn't she, though? So yeah, please direct all your compliments towards my pal Belle, and I'll pass them along to her when I see her next. She's probably snoozing right now. But thank you. Isn't it cute? Okay, crew is here. Let's roll out. Ooh, the ballpoint splatling. You know, I kept telling myself to get good with the ballpoint splatling in 2, and then I never really did. <laughs> I'm okay with it. I can use it, but it's not my preferred weapon. Oh, I'm sure VTuber modeling is big money. Like, even... Not even 3D, but live 2D. Like, just making a model. Not even rigged, but just set up for rigging. Um can be big money, but that's because it takes a lot of skill to do so. Like, not only making really high quality detailed artwork, but if you want it to work in live 2D, it has to be chopped up into a lot of different parts. Um, so even little things like the eyes, like um, the whole, oh, 10 times battle, like uh, the irises themselves, the lights on the eyes, the upper and bottom parts of the eyelids, the eyelashes, the eyebrows, those are all separate parts. Um, and you can even get really elaborate with melt mouth shapes too. Like, if you want the hair to move, if you want... You don't necessarily need, like, articulation for your hands and feet, depending on if you're showing off, like, your entire model on a regular basis or not. And then that's not even getting into live 2D rigging, which is a whole other can of worms. Pew. So that's actually putting everything together so it moves. And I, that can easily be over a thousand dollars. So hey, if you get good at it, good way to make money, but it's a time-consuming, laborious process. Even making a paper mori in um, Live 2D was an interesting exercise. And I, I stuck with a simple model a lot just to teach myself. Um, but even that was fairly time consuming. So I can see why it's expensive to have one made if you're doing like a full detailed model. Oh my gosh, are you in the, uh, are, you, are you in Europe, Poppy? But I would be delighted to play with you. Um, I was actually going to do a little salmon run at some point while I'm streaming. So if you'd like to do some salmon at some point, that would be wonderful. Also, since you're here, weird question. Would it be weird if I drew your VTuber model? Because they're very cute. I love the rabbit ears and cotton candy hair. And sometimes I feel weird just like just drawing people's characters out of nowhere. And I don't want them to feel obligated to, like, say or do anything about it. 
Like, I don't want to put that pressure on someone to acknowledge it. Just like, oh gosh, I like this character design. I want to draw it. Oh, ah, jeez. <laughs> oh, okay, so long as it's okay. Oh, that person's named My Melody. I wonder if they're a Sanrio fan. Speaking of cute bunny rabbits. Okay, thank you. Good to know. Phew. Uh-oh. Ah! So I think my plan right now is I'm gonna do Splatfest matches for half an hour until the stage rotation, and then we'll do a little salmon run. Why not? The only Team Gear member you can respect. Well, I can respect that. <laughs> I mean, Splatfest is serious business. Ah, jeez. Jeez. My melody again. Jeez. Talk about killer bunny rabbits. I used to have a bag with, ah, uh, jeez, Kuromi on it, which is the, um, like the other Sanrio rabbit character. Um, the one that has kind of like a devilish, like, black hood on. But I felt like, man, I look too goth with this. It was a cute bag. But I feel like I'm misrepresenting myself. Good splat and team gear. Or, I mean, team fun, but also curse you. Okay, I think I'm gonna switch weapons. I don't know if I'm feeling the flings right now. Looks like such a weenie with these <laughs> these ink tinted goggles on. Also, I realized I was mistaken the other day when I was thinking how odd that someone had replaced ability doubler because of all the uh, ability chucks. Pardon me, it would require, but I guess apparently, if you want to uh, change the ability on your Splatfest tee, it doesn't cost that many chunks at all. The more you know. You know what? I'm gonna use the ink brush. Heck with it. And I might regret it, but it's fine. Since my right Joy-Con, if you weren't here for the start of the scre scream, stream, screaming might be more accurate. Oh, you hit stop and it kicked you out? Oh no! Hey, new badge! Yeehaw, I didn't even see what it was for. Oh, good. <laughs> oh, okay, so yeah, it's not as expensive to replace the ability on the uh, Splatfest shirt. Oh, I'm gonna make a new lobby, so that works out. I guess, lucky communication error. Okay, Splatfest shirt, it's only three, that's good to know. Even for, um abilities that you have to combine chunks to get, like, uh, Ninja Squid. Really hoping to get through this without a parade of communication errors. <laughs> I think it's okay. The communication error was just so, uh, did you bring a light to get back in? But yeah, as I was saying, before the stream started, I had to spend several minutes troubleshooting because my right Joy-Con decided to not function at all. Um, which is a little dicey when using my precious ink brush here. Pew. Okay, that's good to know. Maybe I will eject Ability Doubler at some point. Or at least I should scrub this shirt. I don't mind Ability Doubler, but it really depends what you get. Oh, we got Stan! Hello, Stan. I don't know Stan personally, but they're on my friends list. Now, I think ability doubler is pretty good. It depends what abilities you're doubling, but I mean stuff like, you know, having like extra swim or run speed up. There we go. The gang is all here. We have double ink brushes. What could go wrong? Did you bring a light? You're our only long range support, so no pressure. <laughs> what weapons do you like using, Poppy? I am a fan of short-range stuff myself. I can use long-range stuff. Like, I like the Jet Squelcher. The Splattershot Pro is good. But there's just something about short-range, like getting up and close and irritating people. Maybe I should use the Carbon Roller. NZAP is good too. I like how speedy it is, and especially... I mean, you get to bring the juice to the party, so what's not to love? 
I love having an NZAP on my team and giving me a boost from the juice. <laughs> no pressure. Oh, you've played the NZAP since the Splatoon 1 days. It is a very good gun. And I've enjoyed using it in all three games. Not that I've used it in this one much so far, but it's a solid weapon. Okay. Someone's very happy about being named Anna. <laughs> I feel like there should be a psychological study done about uh, where people put their jump markers and how like, oh, someone's already there, I'll move, and then they move to where you are. It's like everyone is an honorary Canadian all of a sudden. I see you there, Jet Squelcher. Stop that. Oh, oh, no, no. Oh, and of course they saw it on they saw it on their splat cam. I haven't really used splatanas at all, and I should. I like the splatana wiper when I used it in single player, and I feel like that one's a little easier to use than the regular splatana. Please don't fall in the water again, me. That would be very embarrassing. Okay, good. Where are you going? Where are you going? Okay, oof, that was dicey. Nice, nice, nice. Your Uber is here, but not anymore. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. Oh no, I did it again! No! <laughs> Hi, Joe. Ah, <sighs> just in time to see me dip into the water like a fool. Although in my defense, in that case, I moved my hand off the left stick to brush hair out of my face, and then look where it got me. My hair is wet and plastered all over my face. That's embarrassing. Oh, hi. Bye. <laughs> you despise the gal. Same. I just... The 52 gal irritates me because it's so inaccurate. And yet I hate getting splatted by them because they're so powerful. I can deal with using the 96 gal because the longer range means you sort of have more distance to compensate for its lackluster aim. Um, so more time for your opponent to close in and hopefully get splatted before they splat you. But, oh, the 52 gal. Not to say that the 52 gal is a bad gun by any means. I respect those that use it. Uh-oh. But it's just, it ain't my bag. Where do you think you're going? Uh-oh. Vacuum. 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 Oh, what am I doing? What am I doing? No, 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 no. Heck. Heck. Let me just get my special charge dog, please. There we go, there we go, there we go. Ah! I'm out of here. Oh, I don't think we turned it around in time, but I tried. Hi, Rue! How's Splatten been going for you? Oh, hey, Poppy. Joe here's team fun. Rue, though, I think is team grub. Two-shot kill with a shield to hide behind. <laughs> That is what happened in Splatoon 1, wasn't it? You win some, you don't win some. Don't I know it? <laughs> oh well, I got 12 splats. I think that's respectable. No one can say that I didn't try. You win almost all your matches, by the way. <laughs> What's your secret? I simply don't play matches that I don't win. That's the secret. <laughs> I just made that up myself. Oh, thank you. Genuinely the best Splatoon VTuber. <laughs> I have to play Anarchy Battles more. But every time I think, you know what? I'm going to try the open or that the Anarchy Battle series, it's Clams. And I'm like, ugh, I don't want to play Clams. I played Anarchy Battles Open on Tower Control for a while a few days ago, and that went really well, but you gain so few points for an open victory. Like, even a knockout is only eight points. So if you want to get anywhere, uh, I guess you have to play the series battle. 
Well, drunk, don't drink in ink. That's dangerous. What if you swim in the pool in Mahi Mahi Resort? Regrettably, I am completely sober while <laughs> swimming into the pool. Vimo. Oh yeah, Rue, since uh, um, you had talked about the effects of uh, the vaccine booster, I got mine just a few hours ago this morning, so I'm... Ah! Oh, oh, okay. I'm ready to be censored by the game, apparently. Uh, no, I'm ready to get knocked flat in my feet. Okay, hang on, let me, let me make another friend lobby. Wat wat. I guess. Oh, nice. Not the connection. <laughs> I'm so sad. Series rewards you with enough points to rank up after every second win streak. Okay, I gotta play series then. And I guess even if it's clams, I should just bite the bullet because I think your rank is shared between all of them. Yeah. But clams is generally my least favorite one to play just because I feel like it requires a lot of coordination which you just naturally can't get when playing like this um, without communication beyond Booyah! or this way. Fine for most of the day after the boost, but at night it really started to give you the business. Good to know. Oh, I should have waited to see if Stan came back in. I'm sorry, Stan. Fellow ink brush user. Oh, the Octobrush. Boy, we're all short-range weapons, huh? Maybe I'll switch to the Jet Squelcher or something. That's okay. We're fast. We're irritating. <laughs> I noticed this like a week ago when you're pushing a roller. <laughs> I don't have one equipped, but I also noticed um, a few days ago that if you're using the curling bomb, which normally you wouldn't notice in a match because you're always moving, but if you stay still and fire the curling bomb, um, your cephalopod actually watches it go, and then as soon as it explodes, they pump their fists like, yes, I did it. Switching to the blob lobster, blob, <laughs> blob lobber after this one. Blah blah blahs, blah blah blur. Was it in Splatoon 2? I guess I just never noticed. I feel like there's more details I noticed because of the lobby and how- Whoa, you can just freely try out weapons. Whereas I didn't really bother going into the, um, the, uh, the training lobby in- Well, not really, you know, the, the, the test- Zone, whatever it was called in Splatoon 2. Except if I was either A, trying out a new weapon, which, you know, hadn't happened in a few years, or I was sort of seeing the effects of um, gear combos. I started amusing myself by doing sort of what I'll call novelty builds. Whoa, hi. Ah, oh, heck. Um, things like stacking, say, quick super jump with uh, splashdowns, that kind of thing. Or using a sploosh with beacons and sub-power-up. Or ink mines with nothing but sub-power-up layered. Yeah, I feel like having just all these short-range weapons is causing problems. I mean, I guess they're also all short-range except for that bamboozler. But the dynamo's quite, got quite a bit of heft to it. Dang it. Mm. <laughs> Thank you. You get 12 splats with the brush and then you peaked from there. And it's all downhill, baby. Great. Oh no. Oh, embarrassing. Embarrassing. I swear I'm good at Splatoon, you know, sometimes. Okay, I need to think about how to approach this so I don't immediately get jumped. And of course, they're boost from the juice, which makes it harder. 
Come on, Mori, just get in there. Don't pussyfoot around. Oh, I should have pussyfooted around. <laughs> That's the kind of annoying tactic I would do. I'm gonna get splattered by that dynamo. Yep, there it goes. Ugh. I hate being boxed in. Goodness gracious. I've got their bubbler shield here. If I had more time, I would break that so no one can super jump there, but I feel like it's not really going to matter. Did I get any splats? Jeez. Jeez. Okay, putting Inkbrush away for a bit. <laughs> Assuming we don't get a connection error. There was an attempt. I wonder if they're going to add more emotes that feature the weapons. Because I don't really want to change emotes just because I enjoy the, the weapon-based victory poses. Yeah, that was awful. 12 splats and then no splats? I don't know how there were two or three of them everywhere. Maybe they're cloning themselves and just hoping that we don't notice. <laughs> okay, hang on here. I don't know what I want to use. Maybe I should follow Poppy's example and use the, uh, the end zap. Maybe I should use comeback if I'm just going to get splatted so much like that. Weh. Weh. Alright. Oh, hey, Belle. Welcome. Belle here is the one who made this Octo, by the way, so direct all your compliments towards her. Pew. Pew. Oh yeah, I got the bear ears. I've, uh, I've served my time. <laughs> but I don't want to talk about the circumstances around the bear ears because I don't want to spoil single player. I'm uh, streaming that next Friday. More of single player, I should say. Sitting in the parking lot outside the bank. Oh. I hope your mom's feeling better, by the way. I just got my uh, booster dose this morning, so getting ready to be laid flat in my back. You know what? I could have put this in a better spot. I should have su super jumped away. That would have been the smarter thing to do. Heck, heck, heck. Oh, well, that's what I get for reading chat, but I'm glad your mom's okay. I mean, maybe I'll be okay, because I know... At least for the previous vaccine boosters, I've noticed people's experience varied wildly. And I didn't really get much side effects after the first one, but after the second one, I was just sore everywhere for a day. And then I was okay. And now I'm basically just sore everywhere all the time anyway because of my job. Ha! <laughs> I'm so sad. Okay, I'm gonna put my next tactic cooler in a more tactic cool place, if you will. Get out of here. Oh, brush up there. Uh oh. Well, I don't know if that was a worth tra uh, worth uh, worthwhile trade. Yes, I will be playing in a few hours. Um, I'm probably only going to stream for like a couple though. Just so I can rest a little bit. Pleb Lord. <laughs> it's even better than Scrub Lord. It's like the evolution of Scrub Lord. But yes, that's, that's the ideal.
Don't hide behind your umbrella canopy. Get out here and fight me like a cephalopod. Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? There we go. That was a little sloppy, but I got there. Gotcha. Ooh, that was dicey. Oh, brush. Okay, okay, that was that was better. That was like a redemption arc, right? Whew. <laughs> See? I earned those bare ears. Yeah, I love this version of Now or Never, and just the harmonies and everything it sounds great. And it's just nice to have more than one Splatfest song. <laughs> oh, I got a 12 again. Woo! Redemption. I wonder what's it gonna look like when the uh, tricolor battles start. Since I was Team Scissors last time, and once uh, the other team gets that Ultra, what is it? Ultra sprinkler? Ultra shower? I don't remember what it was called now. But you just can't do anything about it. Yes, I also love the, like that, ba, 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 right before it starts. It's cute. 7 p.m. Central time. Okay. So that'd be about 6 p.m. my time. Oh, yeah, okay. Shop rotation time. That would make the most sense. How long can I just hold this? It's a tuna can, isn't that cute? Who's thirsty? <laughs> okay. I can't wait for the soundtrack for this to come out. I just, I want to hear all of... Um, deep cut songs, but nice and clear. And, you know, like a high quality version of Bing Bang Bang. <laughs> That's all we need. Oh, at least they're not an E leader. Still, I don't love it. Get your juice! Nice. Buckets in the way. Ooh, okay. We're good. We're good. We're good. Ooh. Yeah, you zip cast. I'm helping. Sure. It's like a shield. They can't break the tactic pillar, can they? I don't know. I kind of hope not. I remember it being suggested from, like, the official Splatoon account to use the Tactic Blur as a shield. So presumably, it either doesn't break or doesn't break easily. Florida's in a state of emergency due to the oncoming hurricane. Oh, jeez. I heard it was moving in. I know the Maritimes in Canada have been hit really hard by it. Please stay safe, okay? I can't imagine living in a place where you have to worry about hurricanes just because I've been, you know, landlocked my whole life. That sounds like a very frightening thing to deal with, so stay safe. Make sure your devices are charged. I hope you got food and water and everything. Come get your juice! Well, I love putting suction bombs on the underside of that and then fluffing people up. Feels good. I was really hoping it would get them too, but it didn't, alas. Hey! Don't blow up my teammate, that's rude. I thought their name was Extra Mild, which I think would have been a funnier name. I don't know what MHD means. 
Mad Hat Dead. Which I still have to play. Mad Rat Dead, I mean. I don't have to... Mad Hat Dead is not a thing. Maybe that's like a Hat and Time mod. Boy, they're closing in on us. They're really pushing. Nice shot. Oh, I didn't get that last splat. Okay, good. Yeah, plug your phone in. Make sure you got, you know, candles and... No, we fought so hard. Wah. Maybe their name means extra mad. Because I'm mad. No, I'm not. Oh, it's rotation now. Well, I got 14 splats. That's pretty good, right? I'm helping. Poppy, if you're around, would you like to do some salmon? Although, let me, let me add you properly first. One second. I would like to get more salmon in since I haven't played a lot of it still. And again, maybe I can like officially document <laughs> that bug I've experienced. Oh wow, I got a banner? Dang. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Hang on a second. So first I'm gonna go in here. I'm gonna accept that friend request. Cool. Poppy, are you a Kirby fan? Judging by the Poyo. Poyo! Okay, there we go. But then I'm also, I'm gonna go in here. You are a massive Kirby fan. Oh, excellent taste. I love Kirby. Um, oh yeah. When I woke up my Switch after streaming the other day, so I saw a little buddy was snoozing here. And he wakes up and then, watch him. <gasps> Oh, big yawn! <laughs> and then he's off. And like right in the back of my feet. Um, hang on. I think this. Okay, no, that was, that was a, I think, was that, that was a failure? That's not what I need. Where? Um, this one. Okay. So if you haven't seen this. Okay, look, clear. See? Praise for Mr. Grizz. Everything is great. Everything is hunky dory. Clear. And then. Pay cut? What? Excuse me? And this has happened to me three times now. Has this happened to anyone else? I'm going crazy. Why? Mr. Grizz, do you have something to say to me? And that's like, it's a 20 point loss, too. It's, it's like a, a, if you lost in wave one. I don't understand. Anyway, wait, hang on, let me, have I, no, okay, I did, I did my daily pull. I'm gonna go to the Salmon Run Lobby, which is, that's not the right button. That's also not the right button, there we go. <laughs> He's sleepy. Okay. Your dream is to own a massive amount of Kirby plushies. I respect that dream immensely. Do you have any so far? Okay, I'm gonna make a fish lobby. Okay. Boop. Boop. You did get the glitch where the tent shield just flies off. I know my friend Boogie got a recording of that one with it just flying into space. I should try posting about the issue on Reddit. Man, I don't even have a Reddit account. Okay. You have a great amount of zero. Oh. Someday you will acquire those curbs. I have faith. Would you like to play some salmon with us, Poppy? Oh, you could do it? Yeah, sure, Belle. That would be appreciated if you don't mind doing it. Because I am so curious if it has happened to anyone else. Yeah. Thank you. I don't even know what weapons are in rotation right now, so I got I got the glugas. Okay. What else have I got in here? Oh, my baby. Although, I don't really love the Luna for Salmon. I do have that clip on my Twitter account. 
free advertising. Oh, wait, you're right, you're right. Wait, Bell, before you post on Reddit, clip, clip this bit of my Twitch stream and put it on Reddit. <laughs> so, free advertising, right? People will be like, wow, look at this cute Octo model. I should go check her out. <laughs> Oh, that's right. Bell is Bell is uh, waiting at the bank still. I need to. I don't think I have. I got the uh, Splatana stamper from Sheldon. I don't think I have. I want the Boozler too. I challenged myself to get good with the Boozler back, and I think Splat two. I got pretty good with it, but I haven't used it in a long time. You gotta relax. Which is the trick. Oh, we got Poppy! Welcome, Yolkoso! Splatana Stamper is your favorite of the Splatanas, but not enough to buy it, though. Don't let Sheldon hear you say that. Moved over to the Home Depot parking lot. Boy, you got a busy day, huh? Hi, Poppy! We exist in the same space now, sort of, as Force Ghosts. I wish I could peep everybody's. Oh, you got the cute curls. Excellent. It's hard to see with the force ghosts. I don't know why it's taking so long to match us. Maybe it's trying to find a group of salmon it's to pair us against. I'm gonna get fired if I throw this in the lobby. <laughs> I throw the egg and what bounces back is a pink slip. All right, team. I still love the Shoals own stand-up comic. That's very good. A good Vimo to you all. You like this rotation? Oh, it's low tide, except the Bamboozler. I miss the Grizzco charger. You know, the illegal one? You're a fly fish. Ugh. Nice shot. Have you all seen the footage going around of people um, throwing bombs into fly fish baskets and then the bomb just gets launched back out? <laughs> like the fly fish is like, nope. Oh, thank you for the egg. I still love the noise that uh, the slamming lids make when they perish. It's, just, it's so sad. Oh. Can I reach from here? Oh, I can. That's convenient. Bamboozle are good. I don't care what anybody says. Uh oh. There's a big shot. Oh, I'm gonna flip the flop or two. Excuse me, Mr. Kohawk, don't do that. Okay, oh. Uh, I wanna fire these eggs in the cannon, but if I stay here, I'm gonna get splatted. Little buddy, how could you? arigato. <laughs> If my Japanese is wrong, too, Rue is here and can say Mari. Mari. That's not right. <laughs> the weapons are a little rough for inking ground, you feel, so you've gotten pinched or uh, pinched a lot because of uneven patches. That's true. The, uh, yeah, the Glugas and the Luna Blaster are not the best for inking turf. The Bamboozler is good, I think, but you got to know how to use it. The strafing helps. I wish the slam and loop could have just fallen on the fly fish. Oh, I didn't have enough ink for a bomb. Heck, heck, heck. Stuck, stuck, stuck. Oh, hi, Moz. Hang on, I'm gonna get some of these eggs out of here. Thank you! Good relay team! Okay, okay, good. 
Oh, don't fall at an angle. Okay, hang on. I'm gonna get rid of this guy, and then I'm gonna get rid of this stinger. Because they're very rude, and I don't like them. Oh, I don't like that either. Get out. Ooh, eel. Eel. Oh, did you bring a light? Hang on. Here you go. Okay, let's get some of these eggs out of here. Don't Venn diagram me! Okay, let's focus on getting some of these eggs in the basket. If you'd like to not splat me, that would be peachy keen. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. I guess we're here. We got we got quota, so we should live. That is the biggest priority. We'll get rid of this thing out of spite. Very nice. Okay. You. I wonder if we're gonna get a couple Zuna. Oh, hello. Yeah, that that wasn't happening. You know what I found I could do when the the tent umbrella was in rotation was um. Stand up at the top of the fish stick and then just open the umbrella canopy and then they all just fly into it. It's perfect. Oh, fly fish. Can you not? No one likes you, fly fish. Go home. And then it just cuts to the, the small fry piloting the fly fish and it sheds one single tear. See how salmonids like flipper floppers can suddenly become really troublesome when you have weapons that aren't great for inking turf quickly. Hang on. Okay. Of course, there's a stinger. Let's get these babies in. Egg in. I do want to get rid of those bosses, but we're almost out of time, so let's get these eggies in. There we go. Oh no! I thought it's a Venn diagram had been cleared. It was not cleared. Oh well, we did it. Good job, team. Yeehaw. Find anything better than two rotations ago? Oh, the um, what was it? The the Hydra? I think it was the Nozzle Nose. Was the Dynamo in there too? I was trying to think of like the worst possible salmon run rotation. I feel like the Hydra, the Dynamo, the Tentabrella, and the E Leader. Everything that's just really slow. Oh, good! I got a race. Nice. Woohoo. Nice to actually get a raise. Eh. Wish my real job would give me a raise. <laughs> Dynamo is good if there's good support, that's true. But if all of your weapons are very heavy and have long wind-up times, then I think you can easily find yourself back into a corner. Oh, high tide. Dynamo's really good on glow flies, because you can just stand there. Of course, you have to hope that you have, if you're not the one with the dynamo, you have to hope that you have a teammate that knows that they can just stand there with the dynamo. So I've definitely had teammates that don't. And it's like, no, you can just park yourself there. You barely even have to move. Oh, hi, Moz. Boy, they, they sound so goopy, don't they? Just squish, squish. I want to know what the foley was like for this game. How do you get all of these squishing noises? Come on, Maj, you really have to go for the furthest one? Ugh. Flip 
Whopper. Oh no! Don't you dare splat my friends. Oh, the, the Slamilid shield even blocks the uh, Drizzler missile. That's rude. That came up short, but we're good. Very nice. Nice shooting, Poppy. Mm -hmm. I like that you can hear this thing revving up like a chainsaw. Grizz is just watching out for me. He knows I'm gonna aim for the top. What does that mean? Is he not stifling my progress by taking away my hard-earned pay? Please, Mr. Grizz, I have a family to feed. By which I mean little buddy, but he doesn't need to know that. And also, he probably doesn't need to know that all the food I get for little buddy is acquired for free off the ground. It's fine. He's like a garbage disposal. I mean little buddy, not Mr. Grizz. Well, presumably he's not like a garbage disposal. even get Moz closer to the basket. No, not gonna follow me? Okay. Okay, Moz, whatever. Okay, I'm gonna throw some eggies. And there's a fish stick. Hang on. Ugh. Oh, thank you. I didn't feel a little bad splatting them. They're just trying their best. They're singing their little song. Maybe if they could say it, not spray it, I'd be more charitable. Okay, you stop that. You both stop that. Okay. Now there's a fish stick over there, but I don't think I need to bother. That's fine. Huh. Nice work. Bima. I almost feel like my voice is naturally too soft and husky for an octo. Like, they naturally have softer and huskier voices than Inklings do, but... I still feel like I need to go up a couple octaves, you know? Which I'm not gonna do. You don't need to hear my customer service voice. Nobody needs to hear that. Oh, fly fish. Where's that artwork that's like, Salmon Run is like a social experiment? And it's just all these eggs going into one basket of the fly fish. It's very good. Oh, there's a big shot somewhere. Now is your chance to be a etc etc. There he is. Come on. I wonder what they think about. Maybe they're composing poems in, in their heads while they uh, fire their cannons. Oh, get up there, get up there, get up there. Okay, there we go. Pick that guy. It's wave three, I should use this. Oh, careful, careful, careful. I guess that wasn't really the best use of that, but it's fine. I'd rather my teammates all live. Of course I can't reach, I can't reach. Uh, stop it. Oh, hang on, I'm here, I'm here. No, I'm not. Good job, everybody! 
Biggest change from Splatoon 2 is that you can now booyah right up until you're called back to the chopper. Go to work, team. Oh, hang on, my back is just wet. I'm the only one here without a funny emote, pose, whatever. I hope this is helping get your uh, your rank back up, Andorra. The thumbs up was a funny emote pose. Incredible how well it goes and everybody knows at least somewhat what they're doing, right? This is a good team, if I may say. I've definitely had a mixed bag of salmon teams. Mostly good, some some questionable. Like, I had a wipe on a Glowflies wave. On, it was on wave one, too. Um, because uh, as soon as it started, I tried to rally everyone up to one point, but only one other player came with me. One went over there, and another went over there, and uh, we got overwhelmed very fast. Oh, I don't know what I expected. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Hang on. I am here for you. No, 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 I need to get rid of the big shot. Stop, stop it, stop it, stop it. Eel, eel. Uh, stop. Thank you, whoever blew up that eel. I appreciate you. Oh, you got the big shot, too. Thanks, Poppy. Okay, I'm gonna try running some of those eggs in before the snatcher steal them all. Oh, dang, fly fish. Splat the fish stick before they they land. Does the the pillar just fall over? Hang on, I need to run and get some eggs in the basket. Oh, we're good. We're good. Okay, I'm just gonna focus on living. Hang on. There we go. Okay. Incredible how it goes when everyone has more than two brain cells. Well, I don't want to throw shade at previous Salmon Run teammates I've had. Everybody's trying, I think. Some people just may have more experience running fish than others. What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? Oh, gushers. Okay. Nope. Oh! Lucky! Yes, that's it. Come to the basket. Come to the basket. Come to the basket. Very nice. You put those down. Stop that. Stop that. Stop that. Okay, let's find some more. Okay, so that one's lit up. This one? Oh, no, it's this one. Nice, nice. Very nice. Gosh, I love being able to throw eggs. This is the closest we're gonna get to a good Yoshi's Island in this day and age. Okay, not that one. Oh, thank you! Oops, that's a little fish here. Nope, put that down. Put that down, I don't care if they were rightfully yours to begin with. Uh. Wait. Nice! Almost 40. 
Good job, team. And I want some apple slices cut into cute bunny rabbit shapes. We are killing it, knock on wood. <laughs> okay. Ah, uh, don't don't roll off. Rude. Excellent. Okay, let's throw some eggies. Whoa, 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 whoa. Excuse me. Excuse me. Man, how do we ever live without being able to throw eggs, honestly? Okay, that's that's a lot of bosses. You can you can stop now. I need to revive that teammate. Also need to get rid of flyfish. Hang on, Adora. Oh, multiple big shots. Ooh, ooh. Poppy help. Thank you. Okay, I'm coming, Endora. Get it. Oh, the crab tank can break the baskets of the fly fish. Uh -oh. Okay, hang on. Coming. Oh no, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. No. No. Where? Jinxed it. Jinxed it. That's okay. Next time. Mr. Cruz is much nicer this time around than he used to be. Like, eh, better than nothing. That was a lot of bosses that showed up abruptly. I feel like the big shot often catches people off guard because, um, like, if it's one cannonball, it's fine, but if there's multiple big shots, then it's easy to get tripped up by all that extra, those, those waves of damage radiating out when you're trying to deal with a bunch of other salmon at the same time. Your Godzilla bar is full. All right, let's rock and roll. Let's co-hawk and roll. That's, that was very bad. I can't even pity laugh about that. Oh, I've done that. Pew. Stop that. Stop that. Stop that. Okay. Good, good, good. And of course you just go like just out of reach. Stop that. I still can't reach them from here. Okay, hang on. No, 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 no! Mamma mia, mamma mia, mamma mia, let me go. Beelzebub has a stinger set aside for me. Okay, no, but we're not doing that. Oh, little buddies, don't do that. Didn't your cephalopod partners teach you any manners? Ina. I 
still haven't gotten the Glugadoolies. I wonder if I'm a higher enough level for them yet. They take a bit of getting used to, but they're good. Ow. Good. Direct action. But of course it only got one of them. Ah, uh, no! No, no. Thank you, Poppy. Oh, King Dang. Flyfish, you know what? Direct action again. Too many fish here. I don't want to deal with them. Bobby, no! land right on that. Very good. Guess I know the round's almost over, but I had to get him anyway. I feel a little bad, too. The big shots look like they have a sensitive soul. They were just drafted into this. I really want to learn more about salmon and culture. They're just so fascinatingly strange. I mean, they've even got their own in-universe band. Which, if you weren't aware, all the tracks in Salmon Run are provided by an in-universe band called uh, Omega-3. Which is just the kind of cheeky puns I love from Splatoon. Stop that. So I looked up the Japanese names of the new boss salmonids for this game, but much like the uh, previous ones, a lot of them are just like sort of um, just more literal descriptions of what they are. Wow, I didn't know that could land up there. That was an impressive shot, Mr. Steelhead. Um, stuff like the f uh, fish stick is called pillar. I forget the exact Japanese word. But it's it's pillar. And unfortunately, uh oh, uh oh, I'm oh no, I'm blanking on what flipper floppers are called. Taskete, taskete. Thank you. I love how steelheads can take out other salmonids. Much appreciated. Oop. Oh, here comes the Venn diagram. No Kokozuna. Next time, perhaps. Wish. Good job, team! But it might be the next one. Ah, oh, Lunar Blaster, my beloved. Definitely next time, right? I don't remember where my meter was at, so we gotta see. Yay! Oh, you have to leave? Oh, well, thank you so much for joining us, Poppy! It was such a treat to have you! I'm hoping I can stream on weekends again at some point. It depends on how burnt out I am from the work week and how tired I am and what the weather is like, but thankfully we're not currently in the midst of a heat wave anymore. If you gotta back out, Poppy, I'll leave you a chance to do that so I don't start the match with you, you in it. Okay. 
Okay, here we go. Thank you. Good luck with your own splatten. Even if you're on team fun, I still accept you. <laughs> oh, now we get a rando. What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? I guess who's it gonna be? My Luna Blaster trademarked the bunny hops. Uh oh, ink proof floors. Oh, they don't open when you're uh, online. Is that a cat dish? Where is Lil Judd? Is he like hanging around here so he can maybe get some food? I noticed too that along with looking like he's been thrown in the dryer, Lil Judd, his fur is dirtier, like it's dusty and brown. I heard him described as scrunkly, and I thought, yeah, he's, he's scrunkly in this game. I was at the grocery store the other day, and I was investigating bags of snap peas to buy one for a snack. And I was looking at one, and I thought to myself, these snap peas look a little scrunkly, and I thought, okay, I need to stop. I don't know how that word has snuck into my personal lexicon, but oh, oh, oh. Little buddy stack. Oh, didn't even get to finish one bar of their song. Okay. Okay, Mars. Nice. Not gonna be in time. Nope. Slightly too late. Hang on, I'm gonna at least get rid of one of the baskets here. Okay, maybe I'll just get rid of two baskets. Okay. Best to nip that in the bud. Hang on, it's still. Hello, hello. There's a lot happening. Excuse you, Mr. Kohawk. I was doing a thing. out by the fly fish missiles targeted at one another. Uh oh. Get dark. Oh, it's getting foggy. I seem to recall back for Splatoon 2, one of the producers saying that he found fog to be the toughest of the uh, special waves. I don't remember if it was Nogami san or someone else. But I guess it makes sense that you can't really see what's sneaking up on you. Makes me glad that flyfish have that. Like, if you're being targeted by missiles, you can see where they're originating from. Oh, it's so sad. Goldie with one egg. No. thing about leaving in an apartment. You don't have to mow the lawn or shovel the driveway when it snows out. Ooh, I hate that. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, get out. Get out. Get out. Okay. That could have ended very badly, but it ended great. Good job. Oh, another thing. And a fly fish. Or not a fly fish, a stinger. I'm just gonna... Oh, thank you. Whoever has the bamboozler. Oh, Goldie, don't follow me. I'm gonna go towards the basket. Oh, 
Oh, it was one whole egg anyway. <laughs> Again? Oh, it's Gushers. Okay. Oh! Lucky! Trying to get like one more out of me. Okay, and then here come the waves of snatchers. Put that down. Put that down. Job team. Uh oh. Uh oh. Here it comes. Chiyoshi, you made it. I was wondering if you'd be able to come today. <laughs> Just in time. It's here. Kitakore. All right. Let's find some bosses to kill. Lordy coming. Oh, he's going for the squish. Oh, that was too slow to get them. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Okay, we're getting a little closer now. Yeah, in tandem. And the fly fish missiles. No, no. Oh, heck, 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 heck. Tusk it day. Oh. Ed stole. Ed stole. Oh, no. Thank you. Okay. Oh, no, I need those. I need those. Thank you. Oh, where's the big boy? Big boy up top. Playing Splatfest with the boy from you're taking a break. What team are you on right now? Or team you're on, period. I guess you can't change the desk. That was still a good hustle. You should be proud of yourselves, team. Uh shout out to the fish that punted me into a fly fish missile? That was very rude. Hmm. Hang on. Mm -hmm. Puffing up my cheeks in irritation. Mm -hmm. A Moz and Flipper Flopper targeted the exact same spot. Oof. That's awkward. You get stuck in the muck from the Flipper Flopper and then Moz just swims up like, Oh, hello. I see you can't move your feet. Can I help you with that? Wow. <laughs> the 
it took out both you and the other person. Oof. Very rude, Moz. Did the Moz, like, consume both of you simultaneously? I mean, that would be impressive on the Moz's part, albeit still terribly rude. Can't see. Oh, steelhead. Okay. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, I see that stinger. Are you gonna, you gonna fight me or not? Jeez. Okay. Make me waste all that time. But I guess they did come close to the basket, so thank you. I think. Something I appreciate about Salmon Run in uh, Splat 3 is that if one player's left, now you get that big full screen alert, one player left. Because I feel like I've definitely had instances in Splat 2 where only one person will be left alive, but I don't think they notice. Because they're just, you know, like, usually minding their own business. And we're all like, help! I've also, in, in Splat 2, had teammates who would get splatted, but then they wouldn't say help. They wouldn't use their distress, distress call, which makes it difficult to find them. Okay. Meet Quota, focus on reviving teammates so we survive. Good job. I played some Splatfest. I might play a little more before I stop streaming, though. Although, I must report I am Team Gear, so we wouldn't be able to splat together. Um, you could Salmon, though. Although, you are taking a break, and I don't want to force you to play more when you're resting. Although, if you're in Europe... I think you're in Europe, yeah. That Would it let you play with people um, in different regions? Ugh. Yeah, that's it. All these bosses just pile right in front of the fly fish so I can't get their baskets. Rude, rude, rude. No. I don't think that went in. I did not go in. Oh, get out of there, get out of there, get out of there. Stop that. I betrayed Big Man! I'm sorry! I don't get to play Uno with Big Man in a deserted island. You know, until we starve to death. Or perish from exposure. You know what? No, Big Man. Big Man could be a blanket for when you're cold. And shade for when you're too hot. Oh boy. I'm here for you! Okay, we met Quota. Let's live. Gotta get out of this ink storm first. Eh. Man! At least I would have fun while starving to death. What if, big man, the only thing he brings to the island is Monopoly? Then I guess you'd kill each other before you die of starvation. I like how I ask a question and then I answer my own question right away. Real good, Mari. Real smart. That's engagement. I got my this drizzler missile. Did not get to shoot it back, but I got it shot down. Drizzler is extra bad during high tide, since you have such uh, so little room to maneuver. Well, thank you. Thank you for throwing an egg. Oh, I hear a Maz, I think. Yep, there it is. Darshi Noms. Ooh, 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 oh no! Oh no, no! Live! Andorra, use your special! Thank you! 
thank you, Endora. Oh no, mods, mods. <laughs> oh, okay. It's still, it's still Tuskete. <laughs> wow, mods even ate the crab tank. That's impressive. Yes, you can shoot back those rain-making balloons, and in fact, it's the most efficient way to get rid of them. If you can knock back the balloon right into the drizzler, then it takes them out one hit. You mixed up the ZR and R buttons, that's okay. <laughs> I mean, you revived me and then I got eaten by a Mazd right, uh, right after, so... <laughs> Sorry I wasted that... that opportunity. It's fine, it's Maz's fault. Ugh, itchy nose. Why don't we do like a couple more runs of salmon, and then I'll do maybe a couple more runs uh, or a couple more Splatfest matches, but then I'm going to stop streaming. Of course, you'll still find me on Splatoon later today, but I should try and rest since I did get my uh, uh, vaccine booster earlier, and I don't know how hard it's going to hit me. <laughs> Bring Man brings the Monokuma for ultimate fun. Oh my god, we're just going to relive the plot of Danganronpa 2. Also, hello, Claire. Probably played Salmon Run the most in Splat 2, but never knew that. That's so cool. Oh, I'm glad I could teach you something new. Oh, boy. You know, I never encountered these things until... I don't know, like a week ago-ish? I can't remember the passage of time anymore, but apparently early on there was a, uh, a weird glitch where they would slide around. They're not supposed to move. Um, but apparently it made them much spookier and I'm so sad I missed out on seeing that. Oh, He's trying to get a bomb and there's all these cohawks in the way. Move! Move! This is like trying to get off the train. So many people in this city have atrocious train manners. Like you're trying to get off, but people just crowd you at the doors. And it's like, give me a chance. Like just pushing past you to get on the train. Heck, a gold one. Hang on, hang on. I got you, saucy. Stop that. I wonder if Saucy or Etsto or anyone else will ever realize they're on stream right now. Being judged! Not unkindly, I hope. You know, I'm surprised that with the deserted island thing, I haven't seen anyone make Danganronpa fan art. Very disappointed. But I did see that really good Three Houses fan art, so I'll accept it. Oh. I'm gonna let the, uh, scrapper come a little closer. Oh, fly fish, of course. No. 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 Okay. No. Oh, there's another fly fish. Oh, please, I'm busy. Oh, and there's the little buddy tower. I shouldn't call it that. I feel like it's gonna make it harder to sweat. Deep, 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 deep. Okay, I can't just mash, apparently. That's embarrassing. Uh, way to waste all of that time, Mori. Very proud of you. Very efficient. Ugh. Can I help you? Okay. Does somebody with a more mobile weapon want to get up there and get rid of those? Thank you, Saucy. Oh, 
Where are you going? That's where I thought. To the depths of hell! It's okay, we know all, all little buddies go to heaven. So presumably that extends to uh, other salmonids, too. I don't even know if salmonids have a concept of, of hell. Well, well, whatever it is, Endora's in it. I should make some art in Splatoon. I guess I don't play in handheld, which is part of the problem, but also, like, I see such good art around and I'm like, man, trying to draw with the, uh, the touchscreen is not great. Very nice. One pixel at a time in the deep pad, pain for hours. That's impressive. Hang on. Oh no! The other one had shown up and I just didn't notice. Whoops. Well, you're used to pixel art pain, aren't you, Claire? Not that I mean that in a way to diminish your accomplishments at all, because they're extremely impressive. I respect pixel artists immensely. As someone with no patience. Let's wait for three. Hang on. Oh, there's not even any grillers there to use that on. That was silly. Ugh. Okay. Egg. Egg. You gotta be careful they don't come up the back here, because they can come up the back there. Whoop. I am just gonna live. I am gonna live. Good job, everybody! Oof. I don't think there's a way to draw art in a tablet and port it over to Splatoon. I think a lot of people have uh, tablet, like, smart pens that are compatible with the Switch's touchscreen, but I do not have one. <laughs> Just your squid's forehead. Massive forehead. A bamboozler is not a good gun for swarms of small fries. No, it definitely would not be. Oof. Yeah, the, the little guys really get you. The little ankle biters. Just taking chunks out of your Atil Achilles tendons with your their spoons. Let's do one more round of salmon, and I'll do a little more uh, splatfest splatting. Claire, do you want to do some splatfest splatting with us? Although, if you're drawing something right now, please do not feel like you have to rush. I'm going to take a drink of water while we wait for our rando. One sec. Ah, uh, nothing like room temperature water. I like how we're just- oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Really? Really? The Wii U pen works on the Switch, maybe? I want to do one more lobby, because if I get one more victory, I get promoted, so... <laughs> I'm gonna make another lobby. I know, right? Mmm, communication errors. Mmm, delicious. Love it. But I I can't get over how expressive my Octo Mori is. So you can really see me express my disgust. <laughs> yeah, I learned a little while ago that, and I guess if this is new intel for anyone too, you don't have to save your specials for the extra way, which is good because I was always like, mmm, like, do I want to use them? What if I get a Kohozuna? But no matter how many specials you have, Either if you have all two of them, or if you're still waiting, or rather if you still, if you, let me try again, if you have both of them, or if you've used them all, um, you still get one, and only one, for the extra wave. That was a lot harder to say than it should have been. I'm articulate sometimes. Ugh. 
Boy, this suit really makes me stick out like a sore thumb, doesn't it? I feel like I should be using the Octo with the hair like like this, but it actually wouldn't be accurate because the hair that I've got is um it's mirrored. So um it's a uh, it would not be the same if I were to have my Octoling equipped with this hairstyle. Oh posture check, thank you, Chiaoshi. Hang on, um let me just eh, scootin' up. Ugh, okay. Posture has been checked, back is straight. It is kind of a shame that if you have still both your specials, um, you do not get to keep them both for the extra wave. I think Mr. Grizz says he redistributes them, but if what if everyone still has two specials? Maybe he just takes one from you to cut costs, which would be typical. Oh boy. Round two. I'm just smart, I would roll and maximize my damage. There we go. Little buddies, can you not? I appreciate it. Very nice. Two gorillas. Yes, I know I have an egg in my pack. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, I hope somebody inked this wall. Okay. Don't push! Don't push! Just run. Just run. <sighs> okay. Good job, team. <laughs> Don't you hate it when that happens? I think we could all probably use like a real-life posture check. I guess if you really wanted to be uh, technical about it, you could set a reminder on your phone and just have it come up like every, you know, hour or so and be like, hey, fix your posture, unclench your jaw. Or, you know, clench your jaw, whatever. Oh. Wow. Stop. Stop. No. Bad. Uh oh, don't Venn diagram me! I do not want to be categorized! Oh! Little buddies on parade! Yes, it does. Okay. Eel, do not hug the basket. Very selfish of you. Flyfish. Oh my. Oh my. I like how it's still singing with like the power of the full choir, even when there's only one left. That little salmon and little small fry singing his heart out. Good job. Thank you. Their name is just Image. Imagi. If I'm looking at it correctly, it's hard to see when they're moving. No, Imagi. It's just Image. 
The wave breaker is great if you see your own demise in comics if you pop you back up. Ooh, I never even thought about that. That's some good thinking, Rue. Would the posture check get annoying in a heated gaming moment? Well, I guess you could like set your phone to do not disturb. But then that's when you need the posture checks the most, probably, is during your heated gamer moments. I'm gonna get punted in the water. Why well, I was like clinging to life for like a half second on the ledge there. Thank you, Endora. Appreciate it. This one. Yes. Oh, it's fine. Yeah, you weren't kidding. It's hard to deal with the little buddies when you've got the bad pips <laughs> like. I don't know why you can't just forget firing ink and just, like, whack them with the weapon itself. Just wield it like a golf club. Stop, stop. Okay, if I ever get punted by a, uh, chum or quahawk, I'm just damage boosting? That's my story and I'm sticking with it. <laughs> I was standing on water. It's like I was clinging to the side of it like a mountain goat. Hi, Rye fam! Welcome! I was cheating by using the suction cups on my hair <laughs> to cling to the wall. Except not really, because I've got a short ponytail. So, uh, I don't think I'd be able to do that. I don't think my, my Octo's little side tails would be enough. I, I really do have that bizarre habit of, like, if I'm in peril, I just hold my vowels like Mr. Scooby or there's a clip of me doing that even from Splats the other day. Okay, I'm going to stop salmon for now and we're going to do a little turf before I stop streaming. I don't know why I have to leave that and then I have to... Did I not hit stop? Maybe I didn't. Well, okay, here we go. I'm going to leave the room. I'm going to pick up my rewards too. Okay. Excellent work, everybody. <laughs> what I get? All oh, tickets. Chunks, chunks. So chunks, huh? <laughs> tickets, chunks. <laughs> All right, chunks, chunks. Ah, uh, I don't have enough. I want. I want to stick out like a sore thumb again. I guess you get more rewards available once you spend more scales. Um, but I just, I, I wanna, I wanna save up for, uh, the, the yellow suit. <laughs> the next avatar will be Smug Octomore. Well, I can look smug. <laughs> I don't, I don't need to, uh, um, what you do, I don't need to press a button to, um, switch expressions. This is all me, baby. I think it works out that I'm a naturally very expressive person. Oh, I got a box. What's in the box? Place your bets, place your bets. It's gonna be drink tickets or chunks. Oh, overheated squid life. Well, that's good. The first mystery box had an action figure and two Furbies. Rockabilly elegance. Slim fashionista. Ow, ow, ow. Hang on. Ugh. Sorry. Itchy. Okay. I got all this money. Maybe I should increase some slots in something. God, these sandals are hideous. All you did was buy a suit and banner and it unlocked more stuff. Really? Maybe I should have waited until I was like professional or whatever. I don't want to buy this jacket. I hate it. It's hideous. Rockabilly Elegance, you're pretty sure, is at least four band names and two pinup magazines. 
Okay, I'm gonna go to the lobby and we're gonna do a little bit of turf and then I'm gonna stop. But of course, you'll see me splatting later, I'm sure. All right, gearheads, get in here. I'm gonna make a room. I'm gonna make a password just in case so people st on the stream get a priority. I'm gonna make the password triple one seven. Uh, this is According to the wiki, more things unlock the more scales you spend. So, 100 bronze and 10 silver. Okay, I gotta spend more bronze then. I just- I haven't gotten to fight many Kohozunas. And... You know, I got like 8 bronze scales from that- that last attempt, so... It's gonna be a bit, I feel. Eh. Okay, so we got Did You Bring a Light? And I'm assuming Andorra and Claire would like him as well. Boop, 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 boop. You know, I should equip. I can't change my gear. But I should, I should, um, maybe put special charge up so I can be boost from the juice more. I don't know. Way too much. Like, too much whey protein. I really want to know where little Judd is. Like, he, he used to be, like, hanging out on Judd's chest in Splat 2, but now he's just... He's gone. Oh, it's triple one seven. That's a lot of points for juice. There we go, we got them. Just like a mini fridge, huh? With like tentacle arms. I guess they're energy drinks. I've only got the one gold scale, so. But I haven't encountered a lot of Kohozunas, because I think compared to some people, I haven't played a lot of salmon, relatively speaking. Oh, okay. Uh, I don't think you were here when I mentioned it, Chaoshi, but I'll ask you too, in the off chance someone else has encountered it, but three times now I have encountered a bug where despite a successful salmon run clear, I take a pay cut. And it's a 20 point pay cut too, as if I had suffered a wave one loss. Have you encountered that at all or anyone else you know as? I'm going crazy. Well, Belle said she'll put it on Reddit for me later, so... Majority of what you play in this is Salmon Run. Well, it's definitely been more stable. I have not suffered nearly as many connection errors. Oh, we're a nice mix of squids and octos. That's nice. Sometimes I feel a little bad being an octo, you know, when I started with Splat 1. It used to be a squid. Um... But I like- I like the Octo's soft, gentle voice a lot. It feels more me. If you may have- may or may not have noticed, I do have a very soft, gentle voice. Never happened to you or your friend before. It's a mystery. But yeah, I haven't heard anyone else report they've experienced it. What do you think you're doing? No, 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 you leave Claire alone. I love that refreshing, it's really cute. In the Japanese version, you also get a little pop-up, but it says thank you in English. Man, there's no wire grates for me to stick uh, suction bombs under, that's a shame. Ugh. Oh ho, what do you think you're doing? Hey, hey. No, 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 no. Oh, I'm sorry, Claire. <laughs> I didn't get here in time. I'll get you juice. You're like your vodka cooler, whatever you want it to be. I ain't your boss.
Makes me really happy when people are, are taking the juice I've put out. Love this freestyling. Good, good, good. Ooh, a triple. Where's that ink brush? I'm not gonna go for the quad, they're too far away. Oh, leave Claire alone! Seriously! Oh, good job getting him, Claire. Trying to simulate real life. Getting a pay cut just in case. Yeah, Grizzco is downsizing. So sorry. Ah, good work, team. I think why did you so much? <laughs> it's like every time I turn around and somebody's like chasing Claire down. Let them live their life. <laughs> sorry, I, I protected you too late. Grizz secretly hates me. Yeah, probably. 11-0, that's pretty good. My bear ears give me strength. I would prefer rabbit ears, but I will accept bear. Claire is the only e-leader I respect. Again, to clarify, I'm joking. If you're an e-leader user, I don't mean any disrespect to you, but I respect Claire the most. I wonder if it took some people a long time to find the lockers, because it's not really easy to see them, and if you step far enough away, the draw distance gives you that opaque look, so it looks like an area you can't access. But then I guess if you get closer, you'll you'll see players down here and be like, oh wait, I guess I can go in here. <laughs> to clarify. <laughs> uh, as an e-leader user, you knew the life when you chose it. That's fair. Uh, searching for the lockers. Oh, I hope you have now found them and your eyes have graced so many moais now. Oh, it's opaque until you first walk against the door and hit A even when you're nearby. Oh, you know, I forgot about that. But it definitely took me a bit to find where the lockers were too. Especially because like if you start out in online, you can't open that door like for the first time. I guess come get your juice. Uh oh, uh oh, oh no, we're okay, we're okay. Nice. I was really hoping like that, the back of that suction bomb would get them as they boarded the shark. But that works too. Hang on, I better get rid of this so nobody jumps to it. Oh no! Uh oh, uh oh. Abort, 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 abort. Oh, it's too late. Uh oh, uh oh. And now I'm I'm late, literally. Ah <laughs> uh, yes, my original locker, which had a bunch of splat bombs with a coffee cup precariously balanced on top, but unfortunately. Like, so I would meticulously set it up so the the suction- oh no! The, uh, the coffee cup, rather, not suction cup. The coffee cup was balanced on top, but then, like, as soon as I, I hit confirm to save my locker, the cup would fall over every time. Which I feel like is indicative of something. I can't put my finger on what. Stop throwing splat bombs up here at us. That is, like, something I would do. Uh-oh. Uh, I can't believe I lived. <laughs> I love that. 
Not when it happens to me. Oh, nice! Good job, team. Let's come get your juice. Sorry, teams. No, just team. Just us. Not that the other team's a slouch. Gotta be good sports. Oh. Thanks for the assist, Endora. Nice! Wow, a double wipeout! That was right, that freestyle on this sound really good. Stop. I think we got it. Good job, team! Oh, I can show you my new locker after this. <laughs> but I have edited it. You think you got a lot better since the last time we played? I mean, you were no slouch last time, either. You gotta have confidence in yourself. Oh, you didn't even hit the guy. <laughs> well, you put pressure on him, and that counts for something. Woohoo. I'm gonna take a drink of water. You threw off his groove. Okay. I'm hydrated. Love that room temperature water. Should have stuck my water bottle in the fridge before this. Oh well. I let him live so he can be an example to his friends. After this, you're making some garlic bread and reheating an impossible burger. Ooh, I want some garlic bread. I've never had an impossible burger before. I've had the vegetarian burgers before, but never like, you know, the brand impossible burger. I'm curious how it is. I like vegetarian burgers. If anyone says impossible burgers take like, taste like actual burgers, they're dumb and wrong. <laughs> And Dora's words, not mine. I mean, I don't eat veggie burgers, um, you know, for the, the taste of a beef burg. I just, I like the taste of, you know, like a portobello mushroom and the sort of like bean protein. Um, impossible burgers are meatless burgers, usually made with like, uh, like uh, beans, um, for instance, or you might find mushrooms. Um, I like- I think Impossible- oh, it's a specific brand. Wow, I'm surprised that did not splat me. Did they reduce, like, the range that an Ultra Stamp will instant splat you? <laughs> um, but yeah, I don't know exactly what's in them, but they're a plant-based alternative. I believe there's still a lot of sodium in there, though, so... Not necessarily, like, super healthy, but hey, no cholesterol, so... I'm going to sneeze. I'm very sorry. I think I can beat myself up splatting. Uh, No, nope, I think I got it. I think I controlled it. We're okay, no sneeze. Ugh. Now my nose itches. Don't do that. I'm not used to having a wave breaker on my team. So I keep thinking I gotta jump over the bars, but I don't. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That's not good. That's not good. Back up, back up, back up. Hang on. <laughs> Who's Torsty? Ah. Oh. 
I really love that. Hi, 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 whatever. Oh. I got splatted because I butchered it. Uh-oh. I'm pushing forward. I don't like that. Uh-oh. Ah, oh, no. Thank you. Your sacrifice was not in vain. I haven't actually played with Umbrella recently. I... Whoa. Saw it coming. Life flash before eyes. Um, no, I have not used Umbrella recently. I should. I had some... I got some fun mileage out of the undercover umbrella in Splat 2 with a kit that was, like, all sub-power-up and I would just leave ink mines everywhere. Oh. Well... We had them in the first half, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> That's okay. It was a good hustle. See, look at little Judd, he's so scrunkly. He's all dusty and dirty, like he's been rolling in the dirt. Man, I wish I could do like a sick double backflip in real life. I mean, I haven't tried. But I have enough back problems, thank you. Is there a umbrella type that you prefer, Chiaoshi? They're all pretty good. Now I'm gonna keep this loadout. Enemy 52 gal is better than you. No. I think you're better than them. It's all a matter of perspective, right? I wonder if there's any Splatfest decorations in the cafe. Hey, buddy. I love the weird ambient noise here. Wow. This is like a radio tu tuning. Man, like, your glasses don't even fit over your eyes properly, buddy. That's adorable. You wish you liked the Hero Shot Replicas kit. You're so attached to it after story mode. I mean, it's not bad. Um, Trizuka definitely is not as OP as the Ink Zuka was, but I think that's deliberate because um, the specials in Splat, uh, original Splat, were very powerful. Basic Umbrella, do you like to mix in some Tenta too? Not a big fan of the Sprinkler. The Sprinkler is difficult to use tactically. Um, it's good as a distraction. It's good for passive inking. Um, best advice I could say is, like, remember to deploy, redeploy your sprinkler frequently for maximum efficiency. But that said, it does take a lot of ink. I kind of wish it took a little less ink. Get out of here. You too, get out of here. They're blocked by my own tentacular or tactic cooler. Uh oh, oh. Gotten by the bow spam. <laughs> Suffering with ink problems already. Uh yeah, especially trying to deploy the canopy. It takes a lot of ink. We're having a charger duel up there. Oh, what the... I was over your head! Excuse me! Maybe they shot my little toe as I went up. You know what? They're all distracted. I'm going in here. Goodbye. Now they're respawning and they're they're after my blood. Ah, oh, jeez. Thank you. Whoa. Oh no, roller.
You miss your maxed out ink saver and ink recovery clothes. You'll get them back someday. Maybe even fresher and more fashionable than ever before. Put that octo brush up there. Yeah, stop that. Stop that. No, Endora, no! Oh, it feels so bad when you're just like a second too late to save a teammate. Oh, nice assist at the end there. Good job, team. Very proud. We took it back. I do like the clothes in Splat 3, although I do miss some of my favorites from Splat 2, but I'm sure they'll add a lot more as time goes on, because that's what they did with the first, or yeah, the first and second Splatoon, actually. I miss my straw boater. I have the black one, but I want the, uh, the, the light straw colored one, too. I want more glasses as well, just generally. <laughs> Can you get food? Yeah. Get food. Um... I'm gonna stop this lobby real quick. So, did you bring a light to eat? Or did you bring a light can eat food? Presumably at the food stand. And then I will remake a lobby. In the meantime, let me, uh. Let me do a gotcha roll here, see what I got. Ink dripping incantation. I can't believe I'm actually getting titles now. Kind of like casual world champ, though. It's like, I'm world champ, but I'm, I'm chill about it. You got your food. Great. I still got six charges of this. You know what? Nah, which one did you eat? Did you bring a light? Did you eat one of the um, these here? Because whatever, if you didn't eat one of them, double experience. Okay, I'm going to eat double cash. Yeah. That's fine. That's fine. Double battle cash. For my Tomo Splatchy. Okay, I'm going to remake the lobby. And the passcode is going to be the same, 1717. Oh, there's Carrie! Carrie is also team fun, unfortunately. 1717. Okay. Let's get back in here. In the meantime, I'm going to go peep the cafe again. Squid bags for you. Well, hey, Carrie. Not that she can perceive me. Oh, she's Team Grub. Oh, I was mistaken. Not Team Fun. She's Team Grub. At least they're having a good time. It must be really efficient to be a DJ with super long arms. I wonder if in, like, the next major update they're gonna add, uh, PvP, uh, table turf. Since they have these tables here, and they're in the shoal as well. So, can't wait to get my tail kicked. I feel like, to be really good at table turf, you have to be good at planning ahead. And I'm not. <laughs> I have no doubt they'll make it online at some point. Can't wait to disconnect from table turf, too. Yeehaw. Ever notice how, like, the, the balls in the gotcha machine are actually floating, like they're suspended in liquid? I don't think I would want a gotcha capsule. Like, you take it from the machine and it's dripping. Oh! Somebody has the title Fun Ghost. That means ghost exists. My Animal Crossing title in New Horizons was Occasional Ghost. I want ghosts back. Yeehaw. Stress, no stress. Only splats. Saw a tweet. What's the difference between sci-fi and fantasy? In sci-fi, the money is called credits. Ah. What does that make Star Wars, though? I mean, Star Wars, I believe, uses credits. But if you put aside the fact that it's set in space... Star Wars is very much a fantasy story. Like, it's got all the trappings of a fantasy story. Like, swords, princesses, an evil empire. You know, the, the, uh... 
the, the, the rebel with the heart of gold kind of thing. And even the fact that they say, like, uh, you know, a, a long time ago. You know, it's all the trappings of a fantasy story, I'm telling you. Oh, that's, that is not Claire's wave breaker. Oh. Yeah, there are rollers over there somewhere. Oh, no. I got bucketed. In fantasy, it's called coin. Well, now I'm gonna write a fantasy novel, and it's gonna be called credits. Just to make things confusing. Then, where will you stand? I don't actually enjoy high fantasy very much. I like fantasy, I don't like high fantasy. You know, like dragons and wizards and snooty elves. Oh, boy, those are really fragile. Sorry I broke your little ball and cup toy. Hope you didn't pay much money for it. Get your juice! Ooh. Spicy. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Nice. And I can't get over how good Deep Cut's music is. Like, the sort of Japanese... Indian Brazilian fusion. So good. I think it really fits just like the world building too. You know, just because Splatsville is such like a, a varied city. So I love the whole cultural melange. Uh oh, uh oh. Oh, I was really hoping they didn't know I was there. Ooh, ooh. Oh no. You were holding them at bay for so long. Ah, uh, Does that make Mario fantasy? Yes. <laughs> I mean... You got, like... Reptiles. Dragons. Oh, man, Bowser. They called Yoshi a dragon. I don't know what the heck happened there at the end. We were doing so well. The guy on the left with the glasses was named Nasset, which is like eggplant. Eggplant man. Winning the entire time, then they kill all of us in a row. Yeah, like that. Just, you know, it just takes one wipeout or near wipeout, and then you're in deep trouble. Well, it was still a good fight. I'm gonna blame that Splatling user, because they also had a wave breaker, and it was throwing me off. So I kept thinking, oh, it's Claire's. Oh. <laughs> okay, okay, come on. I want to go for like 20 more minutes, so I'm going to make a new lobby. <laughs> Thank you, Splatoon. Very good. Uh, uh. Again, I understand this game sold like hotcakes, so... Uh, they probably weren't expecting just the volume that they got. Uh, yeah. I don't know why this is here. A challenge, I guess. Excellent. I love that you can see the ink on my feet. Footprints, footprints, footprints. I always get heck when they mop the floors at work. And like, your shoes are so muddy, it's like, I walk everywhere. Okay? Jeez. I better not spin, I'm gonna make myself dizzy. Mm -hmm. I'm just looking at something in the background here. Has anyone noticed, like, it's not like a recent recent thing, but uh, a lot of bots on Twitter that will hop on and follow any 
person that posts something with the word Twitch in it. And they're always like, their profile picture is always like, bland, conventionally attractive lady or anime girl. And they're always like professional logo graphics designers and all their graphics are like the same AI generated stuff. I don't know why they're everywhere. I mean, do they actually get people approaching them? You know, saying like, oh, I like your, your work that, you know, totally looks the same as every other bland graphics designer on Twitch and all these, you know, definitely not stolen emotes that are samples of my work. Yes, please, let me commission you. Very frustrating. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Okay, don't move. Uh-oh. Oh, never mind. We're good. Thankfully, they pulled out their special. buckets on that team. Oh, look at all this from our ink storms. Disgusting. Okay, come get your juice. Don't get splatted, Mori. Don't get splatted, Mori. Ooh. Oh. The bounce. The bounce back. I didn't just jump to Claire to begin with. Time to be annoying. Uh oh, they spotted me. I'm outie. Uh oh. Should not have deployed the juice there. Oh no, and I didn't even get any juice. Oh, I did get juice, never mind. Oh, it's annoying me. Oh good, they ran out of ink. Whoa, what the heck was that? Really? <laughs> the final grandma. Oh, hey, Boogie! Well, that's right, you weren't here the other day, so you haven't seen my model, but yeah. Check it. I'm an Octo. Uh-oh, that almost backfired very badly. Uh-oh, 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 oh no! Ooh, they came from behind. Ooh, oh jeez. Oh, they had a disconnect, but it was a last second disconnect. Sorry if you hear some vibrations. Oh, and now my tracking's thrown off because somebody's trying to call me. I don't want your spam. Go away. Octomori real. Oh, you see my locker. Excellent. Final grandma moment. The last remaining grandma. How dare phone? Well, it's more like, how dare spam call? Oh, because some players were not able to continue, the match will not count as a loss. Well, okay. Sure. Getting so close to royalty. Okay, my plan is to not get splatted as much next time. That's my strategy. What is this? Chalk pens. It's so low to the ground, too. Like, who drew this? Jellyfish, maybe? Lil Judd? I still want to know where he is. Like, he's gotta be somewhere. Maybe when they release the inevitable DLC, they'll, um, 
have him appear somewhere. Or, uh, like with Splatoon 2, they eventually added it so after you complete the single player Octo Canyon, then Callie will show up and hang out with Marie so you can finally see her again. And in such cute casual clothes, too. And it even made it funny if you tried refighting the last boss. Um, then it's just framed as Callie put the hypno shades back on because they look so good on me. Limited edition blade of grass. Mm, noodles. I haven't had noodles in a long time. But oh, you've seen little Judd on the table. Turf. That guy is like the Sun Tzu of cards. Oh my. Kitten has claws, huh? Nice. Sorry, I put that juice kind of far back. Ooh, they've got two squippers. Gotta be careful. Ooh. Just take a lot more bomb hits to explode than I would like. Nice. Okay, back up before I get shot. Come get your juice! It's like it's my new catchphrase now. Oh, they got away from me. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Abort, abort, abort. Oh no, they're shooting at Claire. I'm sorry, Claire. They both had their guns trained on you. Oh no. Maybe I need a juice emote. Maybe that's what I should do. But it would only make sense for this game. Is it worth an emote slot? Not that I'm... You know, using a bunch of them right now. I guess something you could use for, like, hydration reminders, too. spotted. You didn't ink your base and now you're paying for it. Okay, they're coming up here. Time to move. Time to go. Ah. Yeah, use it for a, a hydration emote. out of here. Oh, I think we took it back at the end. I hope so. Digits crossed. Tentacles crossed. Nice. Good job, everybody. Nice job with the sploosh. My bare ears have almost achieved maximum power. Claire always MVP. Even if they're not actually playing, Claire MVP. <laughs> I'm glad you found my locker, Chaoshi, because I forgot you can't open it while you're queued up for a match. But I kept the exterior very simple. That's like me. And my little ink brush. 
I need to maybe use weapons more consistently so I can get more hollow stickers. I have, I've got the Luna Blaster sticker, I've got a Flingza Roller sticker, and the Splatter Shot sticker, but they're not hollow versions, I think. Just the regular ones so far. Oh, thank you. You jumped into Doom like five times in a row, the blood luster's real. Well, that's how you play Splatoon. Even when smug. <laughs> All right, here we go. What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? And we got a knockoff bell. And Felix from Fire Emblem. Not actually, but... I don't think Felix would use a blob lover. He's too much of an edgelord for that. Splatana or bust. Actually, when I played Three Houses, I made my Felix into a punch guy. He was very effective at that. So many critical hits. Jisu for you. Oh, oh no. Ooh. I see the wave breaker and I'm like, oh, Claire. And then I, I have to course correct. It's like, wait, no, no, no. Not Claire. Bad. Bad wave breaker. a little alert so that I I know people have, have accepted my offering of Capri Sun. Actually, you know, Capri Sun would never come into a can. It would defeat the whole purpose. Taking a big risk by pushing forward here. Okay, uh-oh. Oh, we're good, we're good. Pressure up, folks. Let's do it. <laughs> Gotta look at the map periodically to make sure none of them have slipped past me. Because that's just the time of tom kind of tomfoolery I would engage in. Uh oh. Uh oh. If I had known people were dead, I would not have deployed the juice. Okay, and let people come back. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Get out of there, get out of there, get out of there. Oh, no! Ugh, they're pushing back. Okay, nice. Oh, now it's gonna be a little closer than I wanted. Three houses in this economy? Good job, team! Number one tacticaler user. Oh, thanks. <laughs> I actually... I don't even remember. I must have had a Capri Sun sometime in the past, but it's been so many years. I'm sure I would not like it these days. Because, you know, it's fruit punch. It's all sugar. You had Kool-Aid. Same thing with cooler. Yeah, no need to put the sun in the bag when we already have so much of it. I'm gonna swap out of my bear ear since they're already maxed out, and... I don't know what I want. I guess I could use the half room glasses, which would... increase the duration of the juice boost. The juiced. I hey, remember the stats for that last match. Oh, you're done. Thank you, Endora. Please enjoy your boig and your garlic bread. 
10, Claire. Very nice. I hope you have a wonderful weekend. Good luck with any future splats you may do. And may your future salmon runs be a little more successful than they presumably were earlier in the day. You doubt the burger, but the bread, yes. I can't go wrong with garlic bread, right? Extra caffeinated juice. I have mixed this cocktail of Red Bull, coffee, yerba mate, and just a little bit of Earl Grey for some spice. It is illegal in 36 countries. If only all the salmon runs went as well as the ones earlier did. True that. Headache <laughs> juice. Including this one, but shh. That's a secret. What are you, cop? There ain't no cops in the Splatlands. There's only Judd, and he's asleep. Nah, Judd's cool. Judd wouldn't narc. Get your potion. Potion of headache. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Get out of there. Uh-oh. Oh. Should have focused on one target. Oh, I gotta get out of here before that Hydra gets me. There's all this space here that we have not inked. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get that. Juice. Oh, and... <laughs> oh, whoops. That was not a friendly bomb. Which I think I should have realized because no one on this team has suction bombs except me. It's like, oh, did I put that there? I did not put that there. V, and I cannot stress this enough, mole. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Boxed in. World's best bro. <laughs> Whoa. Wah. No, thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Oh. Nice! Way to go, team! Oh, they had a disconnect. Oh, no. Whoop. Whoops. The tri is out for blood, and I don't blame them. I would be, too. <laughs> yeah, a lot of mirror matches, huh? I guess everybody's gearing up. Well, I'm sure we'll see by the halftime report. Can't wait to get decimated in tricolor matches again. Woohoo. Well, I think we'll still get points for the victory, but they won't eat a loss. Like, we'll still get clout. Because otherwise, like, you could try and sabotage the other team by, like, oh, we're gonna lose, I'm gonna disconnect so they don't get any points for the win. Oh, there we go. It is rotation time, so I'm gonna stop for now. Thank you so much, everyone. This is such a treat to splat with friends. Um, I'm probably gonna go make supper or at least eat something, but I'll be splatting more later off camera. So, um, you know, if you spot me, you're welcome to join me. 
In the meantime, stay safe, stay healthy. I'll catch you on Tuesday for more Mario Golf and on Friday for more of this in single player. So, take care. Uh, stay fresh. Don't get cooked. Catch you later. Goodbye.